What's up everybody? Just arrived to the airport and I'm doing a three day trip. Day one of three. Guys, I just went through security. Yo, it is so hot. Like I'm burning up. But anyways, dead heading to Detroit and then I do a flight to Des Moines. The thing is coming out. And then it's a three day trip, so I'm glad. I love a good three day. Uh, yeah, and then, oh yeah, how was your guys' weekends? Or how is it going? My weekend was okay. I went out with my friends. It was good. I took some pictures for my company, Love Charm, so that I could promote some more. And yeah, it was good. The lighting is so bad with the light. Either way, um, ran into my gate. I'm early, so that's good. Uh, and now we have up to 60 plus subscribers, so I'm excited for that, that my channel is growing, or family is growing. I'm excited for us, yay us. Um, yeah, I'm trying to push out some more content for you guys i hope you guys like what i've been doing so far and if you have any suggestions on videos or questions you could comment down below or just let me know guys it's so hot Whew. everything down and I'm just here ready to get this done head you know guys I'm a little concerned with everything that's going on with the C word and a lot of people lost their job and they were supposed to renew the unemployment but they're reducing it and I'm very curious what's gonna happen because I see a lot of people is laughing and I'm like why are you laughing because a lot of people lost their job like a lot of people lost their job a lot of people is laid off a lot of people don't have a job to go back to a lot of places is still closed um the most place not most restaurants are still open but a lot of people lost their job and and they're reducing it i'm curious to see how much um it's going to be reduced to first it was six and now I heard that they're going to reduce it. Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. Do welcome aboard 1951 non-stop services. Yeah, so really, well, I was interrupted because she was making her announcement. But um, I'm very curious to see what's going to happen because I heard that they're going to reduce it to $200. And a lot of people are taking huge pay cuts, you know? Like, yeah, the 600 helped a lot of families. But a lot of people still cannot afford it and now they're reducing it well I don't know but allegedly it's being reduced to 200 I'm not really sure they haven't really come to an agreement and I'm just like a lot of people are going to be affected by this because people are trying to find jobs and there's not really much jobs out there right now so um, come October September October like a lot of things is gonna go down and I'm just like I don't know man I pray that we all get out of this because it's crazy I wish everything could just go back to normal but this is the new norm and I highly doubt we're gonna be back to normal for now so yeah anyways enough of that I'm here ready to deadhead and yeah, I'm gonna go deadhead to Detroit 
and then we're going to Des Moines and then that's it for the day. So I'll see you guys there. got into my hotel room in Des Moines I wish I was staying downtown like last week so I just got in and look what they gave me alcohol wipes I could wipe down the remote and stuff like that I love when you know hotels have these little things so it's now 8 16 I'm gonna change I'm gonna do a quick workout in my room. I'm gonna do some abs. I'm gonna do try and do 40 today and try and up it tomorrow. I'm really trying to get back on track with my fitness journey and my tummy. Oh my god, I just can't with my tummy. Like it just like girl, just just stay flat. Like you know what I mean? <laughs> I miss my high school days. But anyways, um Ooh, the lighting. Where did it go? Wait. Okay. Let me see. Let's see. This is better? It's okay. But I'm gonna change do what I have to do. Work out and shower and then go to bed. I have to get up at like 5.30 tomorrow. So yeah. Not bad. We have two flights. We go from here to Atlanta and then Atlanta to I think Madison. I'm not sure but not really of a long day we finish at like 12 50 tomorrow yeah 12 50 so not bad so when i finish tomorrow i could go on the treadmill and run i'm so glad it's a three-day trip so yeah um yeah let's see where this vlog takes us vloggy vlog and yeah oh i'm gonna do a q a video next week i'm gonna try and do a q a so if you guys have any questions that you want me to answer you could leave a comment down below or you could follow me on instagram instagram at sweetest love charms and sending those questions for me to answer in next week's video i'm gonna try and do a sit down q a try and do like a get to know me i've done one when i first started but i'm gonna do another one because we're getting more family members joining our team and i want people to get to know me uh yeah um so that's that i'm trying to think if there's anything else that i'm forgetting to tell you guys hmm. can't think of anything if i do i'll get back to you guys but i'm gonna wash my hands and everything and get on with my evening the next day good morning everybody it is day two of four of three sorry day two of three and yeah today we fly to atlanta then i think we go to emerson i don't know where but yeah but how am i feeling today i'm just ready to get the day over with um okay so dressed and packed and ready to go okay i'm ready to go 
day two of three let's get it guys woo, 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 woo. <laughs> Hey guys, so I just made it to Madison and yeah, I'm gonna give you guys a room tour. When you walk in, you see this view right here. Don't mind my bags and stuff. And then let's start off with the kitchen. So in the kitchen, we have uh, the this washer. I can't even open it. Ugh. Oh, never mind. Never. Oh, there we go. We have our dishwasher. And let's see what's in the cupboards. Nothing. Got a little pot right there. Let's see. Oh, nothing there. Nothing there. A little stove. Microwave. Cupboards. You got your plates, cups, stuff like that. Got a toaster. And let's see what's in here. Oh, you have your utensils and stuff, your sugar, salt. Let's see. Nothing is up there. Nothing. Then we have a refrigerator, a real one. So, ready and wait to be cleaned nicely. It's like a little like um apartment then you walk over and then you have your couch it's nice sectional don't mind my stuff and then your tv and then boom your bed it's not bad not a nice not too bad setup and then you have your mirror right there and then hello kitchen this is the kitchen From this angle yeah okay then you have your closet Ooh. you got your basket for your laundry your hangers I need some hangers like these to hang my jeans I was thinking to just buy a regular clothespin to put on there but I wasn't sure if it would have been weird but guess not then you have your face basin the whole shebang let's see nothing in the cupboards and then this is the bathroom nicely folded and then boom So not a nice, not a bad, I mean, not a bad uh, hotel. I've never stayed in Madison. I've never stayed here before. It's my first time. So this is how it looks, the bed. And yeah, I wonder what kind of view we have. Let's see. Oh, okay. A little nice little area for you to sit it's like an apartment complex i hope you like that um hotel tour so today is day two of three and i'm in madison so tomorrow is day three of three and i'm excited ready to go home and i hope you're enjoying the vlog so, so far and you know you can't have a vlog without a room tour you know to give a little bedazzle on it when the rooms are stunning i will show it to you guys you know what i mean so yeah um one of my favorite layovers is coming up and well a part i like that hotel so i'm gonna say that and also guys it's the end of the month today is what is it july let me see oh the lighting is better over here um it's july 30th so it's the end of the month and it's the end of my flying and i must say for the month of july i've really enjoyed my trips i enjoyed it it's different layovers different places i went out usually i just stay inside and just be like a hermit but i made sure i went out 
and I really enjoyed myself this time around on this month trip so next month brand new schedule I remember I said that I wouldn't have started with deadheads well being that the C word is spreading and everything um a lot of flight is already being cancelled so my schedule is already in the switcheroo and I'm pretty sure more is to come so all of my trips from for now I start with a deadhead I love a good deadhead anyway so my phone is ringing hold on okay that was the flight attendant that called me we're going to a Walmart but yeah um next month is a different schedule I start with a deadheads I start with deadheads I love a good deadhead love it so yeah and then the only thing that i don't like on my schedule i don't really like my schedule for next month to be honest um but you know it is what it is i have a job and i'm grateful so um the only thing the one thing i really don't like is that we have long sits in between like three four hours so not long enough for me to go to a hotel and chill for the day it's just long like remember i said you need 420 and higher to get a hotel so it's below that so i'm just gonna be in the airport just chilling anyways enough ranting i'm gonna go get dressed and meet with the other flight attendant we're going to a walmart and i don't think i'm gonna take you guys along if i do then you know i'm trying i'm on the hunt to get lysol in baton rouge i didn't get the lysols that i was looking for well i didn't get any lysol at all so i'm on the hunt for that so i'm gonna go i don't need a new pair of headphones as well so i'm gonna run out get what i need to get and come back and i'll see you guys maybe later or tomorrow the next day good morning good morning good morning so i'm here i got ready i'm still in msn and today is day three of three three of three guys why am i putting this up Yay! i'm excited so it's the home day and i went a little shopping <laughs> not a little but my bag is about to be big see so i'm here packing and my lunch bag and everything so everything is set up for me to just throw in and go i'm excited to go home today i think we're on the new aircraft today i'm not sure if i'm right but it looks we are like we are i like the new aircraft it's more space especially for our bags because usually the overhead bins is smaller on on our aircrafts and it messed up my bags so bad like look our logo is supposed to be here travel pro and one of the aircraft tore it up and somewhere else on here i have a rip on my bag somewhere but either way so i'm gonna finish getting dressed and then i'll see you guys when i get onto the aircraft um, I hope you're enjoying the video so far. Don't forget guys to subscribe if you haven't subscribed already. I've been checking my analytics a lot because you know I'm trying to grow my family and I see a lot of you guys are coming and you're watching and you're enjoying yourself whoop-de-woo and you're not liking and you're not subscribing like what's going on like comment subscribe interact with me. I talk back to you guys okay. Um, Hit that subscribe button, hit it, hit it, hit it, hit it. We're trying to get to 1K. So love to 1K subbies. That's my hashtag. Hashtag love to 1K subbies. Help me get there. Um, I've been doing good so far in my consistency. And I hope to God that it stays that way. <laughs> because I'm really trying to grow this family. Anyways, guys, I'm going to get ready. And then I'll see you when I get to the aircraft. What does that sound? Oh, it's a sink. I'll get back to you guys when I get to the aircraft, okay? Guys, so I was right. We're on the new plane. I got the mood light on. And we're on and popping, and I'm excited. Today's go home day, day three of three. And I'm excited. I just love it. Like, look at the bins. It's so much bigger for my bags. And I put the mood light on. Yes. I don't know why I'm excited for a plane, but 
I love that it has so much more space and I just bigger bathrooms for packs and stuff and we have every little thing so I just did my wipe down of everything and look we could turn the mood line in the galley too we're fancy fancy smancy and then the bright light mood bright fancy smancy I just love it um so okay I'm gonna set up too bad we lose this plane in Detroit like I'm so sad because I love it anyways I'm gonna finish doing what I'm doing and then I will see you guys maybe when I get to Detroit oh look at my hair Ooh. maybe when I get to Detroit I will get back to you guys and then after Detroit we go we have a Toronto turn they always give me that Toronto turn but either way I'm excited but look I'm so happy <laughs> over a plane why anyways I'll see you guys guys so we just got here in Detroit now we have that Toronto turn now we're going home so from here to Toronto Toronto to JFK and then we're done for the day special prior for the airline industry because another regional airline just went out of business just like that and see this is why they should renew the unemployment with the 600 because a lot of people is about to lose their job like a lot of people lost their job yesterday in the airline industry and come in October a lot more people is about to be unemployed and I'm just praying to God that um, my company will be good so far. So what I see my company is doing, I see they're giving a voluntary leave again. I guess they're gonna do it month by month. I'm not sure, but if they do, I'm gonna try and, and take it so that I could help out the company because a lot of stuff is going on, guys. A lot of people is losing their job and it's just so sad. And I see people like on social media talking about, oh, I've been working throughout this and it's not fair that they get an extra $600. Like, come on, people have no choice. Okay, you have a job. A lot of people don't have a job and I feel like it's so selfish of them to even say something like that. And like, I understand, you know, like you're working, you didn't get the extra pay. Hopefully we could get a hazard pay or something. Doubt it. But be grateful that you have a job. A lot of people is about to be out of the job right now. And it's just crazy. And if people want to take time off from their job, they're helping the company. They're not staying home because they want to be lazy. They're helping out the company. Like, I just, I just don't know. But, yeah, I'm really grateful that I have a job right now. And if I'm ever ungrateful, I just this humbled me to let me know be grateful you have a job you know what i mean because a lot of people is about to be jobless anyways guys um I'm going to toronto right now from detroit to toronto and then from toronto to new york and then i'm finished for the day it's friday i'm excited um i haven't finished on a friday in a while I actually swapped my trip. I was supposed to finish tomorrow, but being that this is a three, I had a three day and I was supposed to finish tomorrow, but I swapped it out with this three day because it's higher credit. So 
yeah it's better for me anyways guys i'll see you guys maybe when i get to toronto and we had to switch planes so we're not gonna be on the big the new aircraft anymore anyways back to the old plane <laughs> Uh, I'll see you guys when I get to Toronto. Guys, right, so we just made it to Toronto, Canada. And tell me why a passenger was having a whole fit because she didn't want to be around sitting around anybody. She wanted to be upgraded to first class. Meanwhile, first class is at the capacity that it's supposed to be and she wanted to move up there. She wanted to be upgraded. Like she was having a whole fit. I just I don't like when passengers make it so difficult for some for flight attendants because you know what I mean like what's the point you know you're going on an aircraft it's gonna be semi they tell you the rules and regulations when before you're, when you're buying your ticket and everything so you must expect that there are gonna be passengers on board like and sitting near you and plus there's no one sitting next to her and she was having a whole fit you know anyways enough of that made it to Toronto then we're going back to JFK I'm gonna close the vlog out here now I'm gonna close the vlog now so thank you guys so 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 can I say the more so thank you guys so much for watching don't forget to like guys like the video subscribe 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 don't just watch my video on that subscribe I'm trying to grow my family hashtag love to 1k subbies okay so don't forget to like comment subscribe tell a friend to tell a friend to tell a friend to tell that friend to tell that friend to come over here and join this family and hit that subscribe button thank you guys so much for watching i love you for watching have a great day have a good weekend and bye